Welcome everyone. Today we are going to discuss on an exciting session focused on elevating user experience using Qualtrics and the integration uh, Qualtrics with Spartacus. Integrating robust feedback system like Qualtrics uh, with Spartacus is not just innovative. It is essential uh, today. So we will delve into this today with me Ajay Konda our Spartacus lead will explain on this over to you Ajay. Thank you, Matthew. Today, I'll be talking about evaluating the user experience on Qualtrics integration with Spartacus. What is Qualtrics? Qualtrics is an online survey tool where user can build and distribute surveys, collect responses, and analyze the response data within the same platform. It helps you to build and configure survey polls and gain feedback using a variety of distribution means such as social networks, emails, SMS, it can collect the data and the collected data can be viewed in reports and also the reports can be downloaded. Qualtrics surveys, polls, results are reports stored in an Qualtrics secure servers. Features of Qualtrics. A variety of question type including multiple choice, matrix tables, graphics, rank orders, side by side timing, metadata information and advanced customizations such as question or block randomizations, skip or display logic and forced responses, validations, etc. Multiple distribution options including Qualtrics, emailer, customizable survey URL, social medias and QR codes. And ability to monitor survey progress and send reminders and uh, thank you messages. Downloadable response data in various formats, Excel, CSV and different formats it can be downloaded. Now we'll show and demo how to integrate Qualtrics in Spartacus and how the recorded responses are shown in Qualtrics. Yeah, once we log into the Qualtrics project, Qualtrics gives us multiple options to start in survey. Either we can start from an scratch or we can use predefined projects or and predefined project templates. Either we can use some project template and we can edit the particular surveys. Uh, where it gives and predefined templates like an event feedback or we can run in product satisfaction or employee satisfaction or vote and rank or quick poll. Currently, we have been integrated for one of the project, but uh, due to data constraints, we are unable to show you. But this is a sample where we have we can customize the particular survey and we can add multiple questions or we can change the look and feel of a particular template. Currently, I'll be showing you one of the predefined uh, survey template which we have been taken for the mobile. All the surveys where we, we have been created or and published will be under projects. This is a sample project uh, where uh, we have been taken for the mobile data. Survey, survey tab is nothing but where we can use uh, the questions can be edited or and the look and feel. Um, of a particular service, we can change it in the survey tab, where survey tab will give us multiple options, like either we can edit the questions or we can add the JavaScript logic if it is mandatory. The, the question behavior is nothing but where we can add the JavaScript logic if it is an how old is and mandatory, we can add it over there. And we have a look and feel options uh, where, as I mentioned, uh, an existing survey, we can change the particular theme for the particular question or we can add a custom theme for it. And also there is a logo options where we can add a particular survey for an, our own logos. This way, the survey tab where we can customize and custom custom themes we can be added. And we have an uh, so next tab is called like a distributions as I mentioned earlier. Distributions is nothing but a particular survey. We can exp uh, we can send this particular survey either in email or social networks or either in mobile or in web. We can uh, post this particular uh, surveys and we can get the data uh, from the customers. And the collected data, either we can uh, make it in the data and analysis it in a tabular format or in the report section, we can have a different widget formats. And also in the upgraded version where it gives us multiple options where we can create our own widgets. 
as this is trial versions we cannot um, have uh, shown you how the widgets has been created but this is an a tabular format um, where it collects the data and it shows the data into an a tabular format as i mentioned the reports can be generated by the qualtrics uh, either it can be in a different formats so, uh, we can be exported the different format of an uh, data either it can be csv formats or in multiple formats with this export options and also the reports we can have into an uh, multiple designs as well and we have an simulator option in the qualtrics where it provides into different format and we can filter the particular format into the segments where it can be 18 to 34 how many service we got and uh, what are all the options we have been provided and what are all the response it has been given and also uh, Quartrix gives us a particular survey we can run into a particular period. For example, we can run only for one week. The particular options will be provided into the Quartrix. And also we can uh, deactivate a particular survey and uh, we can reactivate the particular surveys as well. Like this, the particular all the surveys can be, be uh, co concluded into a uh, single data and we can analyze the, the data as well. Quartrix gives us multiple options over there. This is all about a basic integration, how we do it in, in Spartacus, um, as well as um, how the survey data will look like. And thank you for your time.